I'm not broken. Mm. I'm just different. You could have a diagnosis. I got mine at 28, but I always really? knew, I always knew I was a slightly different. What made you get that then? I just thought, tell me, go on, tell me, <laughs> tell me what I already know, right? Validate me. I need to be validated. It costs it, it's, it's loads of money. It's like 1,500 quid really? so to have it. Tell me <laughs> there's something different about me, and then I can understand it. And I thought it would okay. help me understand it. No, no. Mm. So I got diagnosed, and I nothing changed. Next day, I carried on exactly the same. There are points when I get out of a meeting, and I need to I need to run around the room, right? I need to get busy, and I can't think before I speak. I will get myself in trouble because I just exude passion and energy, and I just throw myself into things. And I need to explain that sometimes. I need to say, listen, I've got ADHD. I actually occasionally can't help it. When I get out of this room, I'm going to need to run around. I'm going to need to like sprint, right? I'm going to have to do some stuff to burn off this additional energy. And it comes out in moving, shaking, and such a weird thing, but what a superpower for a salesperson or a recruiter. I could not handle the volume or the pressure or the plates I have to spit in, which is the best recruitment analogy to describe. I'm doing this all day without ADHD. So I, I absolutely credit a lot of my success to being capable of handling what people without ADHD or, or, or people without that level can do, but we've probably all got something a bit different about us and, and it's how we harness these superpowers and turn them into stuff for us. And, and yeah, I don't like some of the negatives, like the overthinking, the worrying, the not being able to sleep at some nights and like all the bad bits of ADHD. I, I dislike that stuff, but I wouldn't trade losing all the skills and the superpowers I generate from it to get rid of some of the bad stuff. So I just have to apologize more often. The Recruitment Mentors podcast is proudly sponsored by Vincherry and the award-winning Sourcebreaker.